High School and welcome to the 2023-2024 school year. This is the Greenspun Junior High School Library and I am Mr. S. And I'm Annabelle. I'm kind of like the library mascot. I help my dad with all these videos. You sure do, Annabelle. Thank you so much for being here today as we introduce our Greenspun Library to a brand new group of students here at Greenspun Junior High School. This library is a really fun and exciting place. We want you to know all about it. So let's find out right now. The library is open Monday through Thursday from 7.30 a.m. until 3 o'clock p.m. when Library Club ends. On Fridays, the library closes right after school, right after 6 period. Pay attention to the lunch signs that are here in the library window so that you know which lunch we're actually open. This year, we're doing something a little bit different. If your lunch sign is red, that means the library is closed and you may not come in. If your lunch is yellow, that means that you can come in to check out books only, but no talking because there's a class in the library, but it's okay for you to come in quietly to check out books. If, the, if your lunch sign is green, that means that the library is open. We're open to play games, to check out books, to have fun, and talk with our friends. So make sure that you pay attention to the lunch signs in the windows before you walk in at lunchtime. You should be reading 30 minutes every night so that your brain can grow and learn. Just like our bodies need to eat healthy food and exercise, our brains need nourishment too, in the form of reading. There are two main lines up at the library desk. Check out books and Chromebooks over here, and ask questions over here. The yellow stripes on the floor show you where you should be standing in line while you're waiting. There is a third line here at the library desk in the library, and this is where you can get replacement ID cards. If you just need an ID card, that costs $1. If you want to also purchase a lanyard, that's a dollar as well. So if you purchase both, you'll need to pay $2 to get a replacement ID card and lanyard. You do not have to use the Greenspun issued lanyards. These were just issued as a courtesy to you at the beginning of the year. You can use any lanyard you want as long as it's school appropriate, but you must wear an ID card at at all times while on campus. You can purchase ID cards here in the library before school, during lunch, and after school, or you can also purchase replacement ID cards over in the Student Success Office in room 103. Just in case you forgot to charge your Chromebook the night before school, we do have charging lockers available here and right here in the back office. If you need to charge up your Chromebook in one of the charging lockers, the directions for how to do that are on all of these little cards. The first thing to do is to make sure that you find an available charging locker. Make sure that the door is open and nobody has left their belongings inside. You'll want to type in the locker number which is listed right here on the locker on the keypad right over here and press OK. That tells me that locker 6 is free. Next, I'm going to type in a four-digit pin, any number that you will remember when you come back. Next, it will ask me to confirm that number so that I make sure that I knew what I typed. Next, it tells me to put my Chromebook inside and to close the door. So I'm going to open up the door to the locker, take the charging cord that's inside, plug it securely into my Chromebook, Slide my Chromebook inside and close the door. There will be a message that tells me that this locker is now locked. When you come back to retrieve your Chromebook two to three hours later after your Chromebook has been completely charged, you'll start by typing in the locker number again and press OK. The screen will prompt you to type in that same PIN number that you used when you locked your Chromebook up the first time. So you have to remember that PIN number that you typed. And then the locker door will pop open and you can retrieve your Chromebook. If you forget your password, then you have to wait until sixth period when the lockers are programmed to open automatically and your Chromebook will be delivered to you in your sixth period class. So make sure that you type in a PIN number that you'll remember when you come back when your Chromebook is charged up. Hey, no snacks or sugary drinks are allowed in the library. You are allowed to have water, however. <laughs> Oh,
Hey! No running in the library! Check out books and Chromebooks over here. Ask questions over here. Oh my gosh, I can't believe she did that. Yeah, that's totally crazy. What, where am I? Oh no, I'm just here in the library talking on my cell phone as loudly as I can and being really super annoying. Hey, the cell phone zone is outside. You may use your cell phone in the library on silent if you're using earbuds and headphones only during your free time, before school, during lunch, and after school, but never when you are here in the library with a class. We should not be able to hear what you are saying or what's on your cell phone at any time here in the library. Push in your chairs, you animals! Didn't your parents teach you any manners? In the back of the library are the emergency exit doors. Please do not go through these doors unless it's an emergency or else this will happen. <laughs> Reading is exercise for your brain! You can return your library books here inside the library or you can return your books to the library book drop that's outside just in case the library is closed for a meeting or something. Simply open the door and drop it inside. Huh? Please sit two per table when you are in the library and don't move chairs over to another table. If you want to sit with more than two people per table, please use the blue tables that are outside. This is a photograph of Hank Greenspun, not George Bush. <gasps> Dad, there's no yelling in the library. Oh, yeah, that's right. The Chromebook Help Desk is right here in room 302. You can come to the Chromebook Help Desk with a pass from your teacher for any help that you might need with your passwords, your accounts, or your Chromebook. The first thing you want to do when you come in with a pass from your teacher is you need to submit the Tech Help Request icon from this Chromebook that's sitting right here on the table. That gives us a record that you were here at the Help Desk and we know what time you were here and what time you left. If there isn't anybody here at the Help Desk, there is a doorbell right here. You can push that doorbell so that I know that you need help. The Chromebook Help Desk is not a shortcut to the library, so please do not use the Chromebook Help Desk as a shortcut to the library or the cafeteria. Thank you. If you change your mind about a book that you took off the shelf, please don't try to figure out where it went on the library shelves. Simply Leave it here on one of two book carts that are available to you in the library, and the student aides and I will put it back on the shelf in the correct spot. When you are looking for a book to read in the Greenspun Library, the first thing you need to know is your reading level, and it's a good idea to know your ZPD, which means which reading levels of books you should be reading based on your star reading test scores. You should get a sticker from me when you do your star reading test, either with your teacher in the classroom or right here in the library. Once you know your reading level, you want to pick out a book that's in your reading range. Every book in the entire Greenspun Library has a sticker on the spine that shows what the reading level and the number of AR points is for every book. Now, every teacher has a different required number of AR points. So as long as you read enough books to add up to your teacher's requirement, you will do a great job with reading this quarter. There are approximately 15,000 books in the Greenspun Junior High School Library, but there are over 200,000 AR books in the entire universe. That means that a lot of the books that you might already have at home or at the public library or even online are probably AR books too. Before you read an AR book for credit though, make sure you check the website arbookfind.com to make sure that the book that you're reading is in your reading level and that it's an AR book. AR Bookfind will also tell you how many points an AR book is worth. The library also features a virtual classroom that doubles as the Nintendo gaming area. You could be chosen along with three of your friends to play the Nintendo Switch during your lunch. You'll receive an invitation in your third period class if you win. The more books you have checked out from the Greenspun Library, the more chances you have to win a chance to play the Nintendo Switch.
You can also play the Nintendo Switch in Library Club after school every single day. There's one Nintendo master who is chosen, who is in charge of the Nintendo, who decides who gets to play the Nintendo Switch every single day. Look at the library website for more information. You can check out two library books at a time in the Greenspun Junior High School Library. You can also check out two ebooks for a total of four books that you could have checked out at the Greenspun Library. When you find the books that you would like, simply bring them up here to the library desk where it says check out books here, type in your student ID number on the keypad, and the student aid will take care of the rest. In the back of the book, the student aid will stamp the due date for when the book is due for when you have to bring it back. You have 21 school days to bring back your library book, but you can renew a library book three times if no one else is waiting for it. You can also check your Destiny Discover account at destinydiscover.com to see your due dates for all of your library books as well. Reading is an exercise for your brain! Some books in the Greenspun Library require parent permission to check out. Simply bring the book up to the circulation desk to check out, and when the book is scanned, it will print a permission slip for you to take home and get signed by your parents. Bring that signed permission slip back the next day, and we'll trade you the book for the permission slip. Check out books and Chromebooks over here. Ask questions over here. DestinyDiscover.com is the library catalog. This is where you can not only look up every single book in the entire library, you can also see which books are brand new in the library, and you can look up and read our entire ebook collection. We have hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of ebooks that you can read and earn AR points for in your reading and eighth grade English classes. Additionally, there's a My Stuff tab up at the top that will show you every single book that you have ever checked out in your entire life in the Clark County School District. You can actually go back and look at the books that you checked out in kindergarten. Under the My Stuff tab, you can find lots of other information too, including your current checkouts, and you can also see any fines that you might have on your account, maybe a Chromebook fine or even a library book fine from this school or another school. The other thing you could do is you could do all of your research on Destiny Discover using research databases, which are far superior to doing your research on the internet. You can log into Destiny Discover by using Clever or visit our website at greenspinejhs.com for more options for how to log in to destinydiscover.com. When you enter the Greenspun Junior High School Library, the fiction books will be immediately to your right. Those are chapter books like Harry Potter and Percy Jackson, things like that. Books with chapters. And over here on the left-hand side of the library, we have our nonfiction section. Nonfiction means not chapter books. Those are all the books about true topics like science and history. Also over here, we also have our graphic novel section. Those belong in the nonfiction section as well. There are 17 different Chromebook desktop computer stations here in the library that you can use to log into your school Google account so that you can access anything you need to access. Sometimes students like to use these if they forget their Chromebook or if they put their Chromebook in the charging locker and they don't have their personal Chromebook at the time. You can use one of these 17 Chromebook desktop stations. You may also find some of these Chromebook desktop stations in some of your teacher's classrooms as well. The library also has lots of really cool games like Marble Run, Chess, Checkers, and even Ping Pong. Please always be kind and play fair or don't play at all. <laughs> library Club is here in the library every Monday through Thursday from 2.15 until 3 o'clock p.m. There is no Library Club on Fridays, however. You're allowed to just drop in any day that you would like and play any of the games that we have available here in the library. You can sit and do homework while you're waiting for your parents to pick you up, or you can chat quietly with friends. You do not need to sign up for Library Club ahead of time. You would simply sign in on the library website on your own Chromebook when you arrive for Library Club. The library website at greenspunjhs.com features lots of resources and links that you might need access to, including Destiny Discover, Myon, Accelerated Reader, AR Book Finder, and even our printing services. You can print anything that you need for a class here at Greenspun for free by submitting it from our printing services icon, and then you can just come and pick up your printout here in the library.
Oh, hey, don't mind me, just getting another set of 10 reps, of pages that is. Reading is exercise for your brain! Okay, everybody, that is everything that you need to know about the Greenspun Junior High School Library for this 2023-2024 school year. Annabelle, thank you so much for helping me out with yet another video. I'm really looking forward to a great year this year with lots of fun and reading lots and lots of books here in the Greenspun Library. So everybody have a great year. Everybody have a fun year this year. Bye-bye. Bye. 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 Bye-bye. Bye. Bye. And outtakes. Bye. <laughs>